Hey everybody, it's Lee here. So in this video, I thought I'd just do a quick uh, overview of the uh, blockchain Bitcoin wallet application uh, for the iPhone. Uh, it's also the same uh, application. It's also available for uh, Android devices as, as well as. Um, so we're just going to uh, jump in. So it's the blockchain app. Uh, we have some basic security here. So we just enter our pin. It says it downloads the uh, wallet, but it doesn't actually, uh, it doesn't download the the whole sort of bo uh, blockchain or anything like that. So it synchronizes really quickly. Um, basically, uh, what it has is like a, a local wallet file uh, that's stored within your phone, but then it accesses the actual blockchain data uh, via the blockchain.info uh, website. Um, so you don't have to worry about, uh, like I say, downloading the blockchain, which can normally be quite uh, time consuming and com cumbersome if you do that, uh, you know, via the Windows uh, Bitcoin uh, QT sort of application. Um, so this is the main uh, sort of starting interface. Just press the coins there. Uh, you can see we've got a small uh, Bitcoin balance of 0 0.0588 uh, Bitcoin. Uh, and it also tells you the equivalent amount in dollars, uh, which is currently $26.99. Uh, below that, you will see there is a uh, some sort some of the recent transactions, and so you can see at the bottom I received uh, 0.499, and then there's some outgoing transactions as well further up. Uh, so the the main use or the main sort of purpose of this particular application, or the thing that I like about it, is just that it's a really easy way for you to sort of send and receive uh, Bitcoin. Probably one of the easiest ways um, that you can sort of get involved with it. Uh, so up on the top right hand corner, um, you'll see it sort of uh, basically changes to like a camera mode. And if we uh, use that, it will actually pick up the QR code on any other device. So for example, if you've got a friend uh, that also is running the same uh, application, the blockchain application, they can basically show you their QR code. You just scan it with your phone and that's how you get the address. Rather than uh, you know manually inputting or copy and pasting a uh, Bitcoin address, it's a much more uh, practical way of doing it. So that's just how that works. I'll just show you again, if you just go scan the QR code and then I've already got it on my screen there. It just waits till it focuses and then it automatically captures it. Then what it does is it translates that QR code into a Bitcoin address. And then from there we can just enter uh, whatever amount we lo we would like to send. Um, so if you just enter the, the Bitcoin amount, it automatically shows you a US dollar um, exchange rate and um, so that's quite helpful i'm just going to exit out of that because it's not actually a, a uh, an address that i want to uh, send any bitcoin to and um, so just going to go back to the main interface uh so from here like i said before it just shows you a brief overview overview of your uh, previous transactions uh the other thing that's worth showing is on the bottom right hand side you've got basically like a receivables so if you press that this is what you would do or this is what you would share if you wanted to uh, receive uh, Bitcoin from another person. So just in the, the way that we've uh, selected a QR code and then to send a transaction, someone else would scan this QR code and that would allow us to receive uh, Bitcoin. So that's it. So really uh, straightforward way to send and receive Bitcoin. So you've got the, uh, the send in there and the receive in there and the sensor one is just uh, an overview of your transactions. So yeah, this was just a short video. I just wanted to share with you the actual blockchain app available for your iPhone and um, what the basic sort of uh, overview of it is, how it works, etc. Okay, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching.